<laughs> Hi, everybody. Welcome to a quickie with Miss B. I'm so glad you're back for another weekly episode. Today is Monday. <laughs> All day, half the night. Uh-huh. <laughs> I can't tell you what happens in the other half of the night. Because I don't know. <laughs> Thank God. <laughs> Anyways, I thought we would talk about, you know, some of the world or weirdest tourist attractions that are out there. Because I think that, you know, once we can get out there and start traveling again, you really should check some of these places out. <laughs> Said no one ever. <laughs> yeah. there, there's plenty of stupid things to see out there. <laughs> yes, there is. <laughs> I got to stretch my legs. Well, let's do it near that uh, giant pan. Yeah. <laughs> big pan down the street here. Let's go look at the big pan. You know, when I was doing this, when I was looking at some of these uh, various places throughout the states, do you know if they actually have drive-by attractions? <laughs> drive-by. Yeah. This one's not worth getting out of the car for, but you could just, like, shoot on by at, like, I don't know, 35. <laughs> different attractions yeah. work different speeds. This one really sucks. So this is a 65 mile an hour. Attraction. You just whip by and tell the kids, look out the window. You good? We're good. Some of them is like a 15 mile an hour. You, you actually like tap the brakes and slow down. <laughs> I'm thinking that's the way they're going to do it. According I, to I like wonder, how I wonder good. The giant, the giant ball of string. I wonder what that one is. Isn't that a walk up? I've actually been. Oh, I've actually been that? to that one. I don't remember what. You think I actually logged in my memory where oh, this where okay. this amazing a, feat happened that I saw there a, is a ball of string? There's a giant ball of twine. That's the one. Yeah, it's in Cocker City, Kansas. That's why, because I live in Topeka. That's why. I live. <laughs> <laughs> okay, it's a real it, it's a real coca. It's a real coca out there in Caca. <laughs> Caca, Kansas. <Why>? <laughs> Cocker City. I mean, who thinks of names for cities? Oh my God! Yeah, let's go to Cocker City. I want to see the giant ball of twine. Well, it would make sense if they went. Let's go to Cocker City. What? I got a big chicken. <laughs> what do you mean a big? It's a cock. It's a real big one. It's a real oh, cock. Wow! Can you imagine? Uh, oh, I didn't research oh, that. I couldn't find out where the no, giant cock know. was in the oh. states for the weirdest tourist attraction. <gasps> Opportunity missed. <laughs> Crap. <laughs> I it's was so hopping sad. the car road trip. <laughs> it is so sad how excited you are about that. <laughs> and, and I'd have to get my picture taken too. <laughs> oh, yeah, there you go. Right, right. next to the cock. But well, I don't think good. I can get very, I mean, wow, if it's like jihugical, can you imagine? I don't even think, like, wow. All you could see is his foots. It would be me in his foots in a picture. <laughs> foots? Foots. <laughs> you pluraled foots. a singular word. All right. The word is feet. All right. That's the plural. But you decide to plural foot. Foots. He, yes, has, he, has, I... two, he has two foots. He doesn't have two feet. He doesn't have a couple of feet. He has two foots. <laughs> I have my own singular definition. Foot. I have my own dictionary, you know, underwears, foots. I'm going upstairs to brush my tooths. <laughs> I have more than one tooth, so I'm going to brush my tooths. That's why I have no, the tooth. I have the tooths brush. <laughs> Well, why is it you brush your teeth, but you have a toothbrush? You ever think about that? Yeah. All the time. <laughs> Does it make it I, I, I lay, well, I mean, it was, in, it was, I think the toothbrush was invented in the South. That's why it's called a toothbrush. <laughs> yeah, if but it, it brushes in, it, all of them. Right. Which well, is was, I teeth. think it was invented in the South. It was, if it was invented up North, it would have been a teeth brush. <laughs> Sorry, Sal. That was a joke. I almost had to lead her there with, uh, you know, the lights for the landing and all that. Trying to bring her to the joke, but, oh, yeah, that was hard. That was hard. Oh, jeez. 
Uh, does that mean it's teeth paste then too? Yeah. yeah. <laughs> if it was made up north, it's teeth paste with a toothbrush. And if it's down south, it was toothbrush with a toothpaste. <laughs> Sorry, South. It was a joke. That's all. <laughs> <laughs> oh my gosh. Do you realize that we wasted like almost the whole first episode, first half of the episode on talking about just. It had stuff. to do with it had to do with tourist attraction thingies. <laughs> there was stuff in there. I wonder if they have the world's largest toothbrush. Well, why don't we go on break and you uh, can check that out? I'm gonna check though the toothbrush and the cock. Back in a moment. Welcome back, everybody. You're listening to a quickie with Miss B. If you missed the first half of the episode, please go back and check that out. Thank you for joining us today and every other day that you've been here. And I don't know why you keep coming back, but I'm so glad that you do. And hey, you know what? You should bring lots of friends. Tell them because you know what? This week, you're not going to want to go it alone. We're talking about the world of strange attractions. Well, hold hold on. on. You you glazed right over that. Very, very well. (laughs) You know what a fine job you, to, you did of glazing. You know over. what? You need to you, you need to stop being the crossing guard with the stop sign, okay? <laughs> I'm supposed to just keep right on going, but no. Oh, Enter John. Oh yeah. Well, you were you, you were going to go look up some stuff. And you went to the <clears throat> How'd that go? <laughs> well, let me tell you, boys and girls. You have to be very careful about how you type things into the Google search. <laughs> Really? Yes. So you didn't find you didn't find any giant roosters? <laughs> nope. <laughs> <laughs> but Pablo, on the other hand, has the world largest fill in the blank. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Be, car- be careful, kids, how you type those uh, special things in there. Let that innocence run loose, and all of a sudden you're like, "Where'd you type it?" That? No, I'm yelling. Don't, don't, don't type that in. Oh, yeah. All right. <laughs> I was halfway through typing out the sentence while well, you're—he's just starting to say, "Don't type," and then I hit the enter button, and all you heard was, "Oh." <laughs> uh, yep. Yeah. Do you know that they come with pictures? Yeah. Uh, mm. yeah. Okay. There you go. My eyes. <laughs> Innocence. Yeah. Set yep. loose. <laughs> well, anyways, they do have the world's largest rooster. I didn't find that information. Um, oh, you did. Where, where'd you find that? Yeah, I, I don't. I don't think they gave an actual location as to where this chicken resides. The rooster. But it's a rooster. It's the biggest one in the world. It's a massive Braham. Braha. Bra. Bra. Brahma, Brahma. It's a rooster chicken. It's uh, uh, also known as the giant chicken, and it's the world's largest. And I gotta tell you, I mean, holy cow, the size of this uh, chicken! (laughs) They're huge, and they come in all kinds of different colors too: brown, white, like salt and pepper. That's just crazy. That is just crazy. I don't even know how that happens. What, there's different colors? Yeah, there's different it's colors. Just, there's just like the a natural stuff that happens. They, oh, know. yeah. And oh, the size of their foots are huge, too. Some of them wait, got wait, wait, really wait, 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 wait. The size of their foots? We're doing the singular multiples again now? Foots? Really? Foots? Not feet the size of their feet. Nope, nope. It's foots. There's more than one foot, so it's foots. <laughs> they're flipping huge. And, oh, they're hairy, too. Some of them have got, like, a whole bunch of chicken feathers on them. So they're not wow. hairy. They're not hairy. They'd be feathery. Feathery. they got feathery. They have feathers. They're so hairy. What? <laughs> they're huge. Wow. 
That's crazy. So yeah, that actually does exist. So, you know, if you want to know more about it, you're gonna have to go look it up yourself there, boys and girls. And yes, they do have the world's largest toothbrush in case anybody's interested in going to Safari Park Karachi. Karachi? Karacha. Karacha. Yeah, that's where you can find the world's largest toothbrush. They actually have a, a photograph of it out there on Google too, so you can search that. Okay, <clears throat> the one that we're going to talk about now is the weirdest tourist attraction is in Massachusetts <clears throat> in Worcester. Did I say Worcester, that right? Yeah, Worcester. Worcester. Okay. Um, it's a statue that you can find there, and it's called Turtle Boy. <laughs> Turtle <laughs> now, let Boy, me explain the statue. What- it looks like the statue is of a naked boy with a sea turtle <laughs> as a big and weird tourist attraction. It's <laughs> obviously not natural looking because the naked boy is sitting on the sea turtle, but it, he doesn't look like he's sitting on the sea turtle. He he looks like he's doing something else. Oh, no. <laughs> Yes. <laughs> According to Roadside America, the sculptor died before he could complete the statue. So <laughs> they're still wondering to this day what was supposed to be the finishing design. <laughs> In on a side note. The turtle, I don't know if he's really happy because he kind of looks like he's going, ah! All right, well, this is a special time. (laughs) (laughs) I'm just saying. (laughs) So, yeah, that's one of the attractions that you can find as the weirdest ones (laughs) in our youth. In our states. <laughs> All right. Oh, yeah. <laughs> yeah. Why not? It's like a train wreck. You can't stop looking at the picture. You people need to Google this, really. <laughs> Turtle boy. Say it. Turtle boy. And on that note, we need to go. 